this is so important and I wanted to get this out to my thousands of students now. So no makeup, I know, but this is time sensitive, so it's worth it. And if you have been wondering if it's time for your Instagram content marketing plan for your business, if it needs a refresh for 2022, well, this video is for you. Hey, what's up, everybody? It's Stacey Storino. Welcome back to my channel, the number one place to learn about crafting content that converts content consumers into actual customers. I've got eight years of experience coaching thousands of students across the world under my belt, and a lot of what I've seen has led me to create this video titled My 2022 Instagram Strategy, Why I'm Changing. Spoiler alert, my content marketing is bringing me conversions, but then again, I have a brand-based community that I've built for years. Nevertheless, I'm wanting to keep my content marketing fresh, so I'm gonna give it an update. And I think that regardless of how well your business is doing or not doing, you should join me on this journey too. But before we get started, make sure to hit that like button and subscribe to get the help that entrepreneurs like you need to succeed with content marketing that drives traffic to your business so that you can do more business. Okay, so what I'm changing on Instagram. So super fast, even if you're an older, more mature entrepreneur, and even if this is going to make you sad to hear because you do not want to create video of any kind, it's time to double down on Instagram Reels if you've been doing them, or even triple down if you can before the golden window of opportunity that Instagram CEO Adam Mosseri discussed recently shuts and you're left out in the cold. And if you're not doing Instagram Reels, you super need to start, and I'm gonna show you why in this video. So sure, I played around with Instagram Reels and then, real talk, I fell off the wagon. I used every excuse in the book not to do them. I'm old, I'm heavy, I have facial palsy. I don't wanna dance or sing, you don't have to. I'm a more mature entrepreneur and I don't wanna be bothered with being on camera in that way. Shooting a talking head video like this one? Sure, I can do that all day. But Instagram Reels? Uh, nah, except now, whoops, things have changed. The CEO of Instagram, Adam Osiri, has said that Instagram's not a photo sharing app anymore. It's a video sharing app first and foremost. Preferential reach is going to be given to Instagram Reels up to 60 second vertical videos at this point. Anything longer than that, which is a vertical video, will be an Instagram TV video, formerly known as IGTV. This extra bonus lead reach is not gonna last forever. Instagram's trying to stay competitive with TikTok, so that's why they're giving you so much bonus reach for now. At some point, the extra algorithmic boost or reach will decline as more Instagrammers become content creators and aren't just content consumers. So before it's too late, I'm going to create Instagram Reels at least once a day, up to three or four if my schedule will allow for it, because I want the unfair advantage that's going to give me reach in the hundreds to thousands or more per Instagram Reel I publish that I can get right now. If Just like if I knew what I was doing years ago, I'd get insane reach on Instagram for any static image post I'd publish or any carousel that I'd put up. Plus, Instagram Reels are getting ridiculously large real estate on Instagram's Explore page. I decided to go out on a limb and look up a random product-based business term on Instagram, quilting. And just look at how big and long the Instagram Reel is. It's a big old rectangle compared to the static image posts and even the carousels that are in the search results or Explore page. My goodness, that top left corner reel is getting an unfair advantage over everyone else. A picture is worth a thousand words. And if you're a coach, a course creator, or any other kind of business owner, guess what? You can get this no matter what keyword or hashtag you're trying to rank for right now. Months to a year later, good luck. So that's why I'm changing my Instagram strategy in 2022 to aggressively include Instagram Reels. I might not love creating them, but I'll love the results I can all but guarantee you. What I'm keeping the same. 
Sure, I'm gonna post one, two, three pieces of Instagram story content a day. That's something my current following engages with and yours will too. Instagram Reels is key for discovery. Mr. Moseri has said as much right now. It will grow your account and that's a beautiful thing as a business owner. That means more people in your sales funnel. But your current following needs to know, like, and trust you a lot more over time or they're not likely going to buy from you. They'll like you enough to follow you and that's it. Followers? You can't deposit them in the bank. So I can't ignore doing a great feed post once a week. That's a real resource. Whether it's an Instagram TV video with a great teaching contained in it or a static image feed post whose caption is like a value-filled micro blog post that can help my ideal customer or a carousel that works like a mini tip guide or even a mini catalog, if that's something I wanna do. These are things that will pack my feed full of value for an ideal customer who isn't a visitor yet, because then they're more likely to give me a follow and stay in my brand-based community, and they will help to keep my brand-based community well-fed and happy with me and my content so that when they're ready and able to, they will know, like, and trust me, my brand, and my offerings enough to buy what they need to help them to succeed. So, of course, I recommend that you do more of this sort of activity, too. The price of poker went up, folks, but you can win the game if you leverage the algorithms running on the Instagram platform to grow your account, grow your following, and transform them into customers one piece of content at a time. So that's enough out of me. Now I want to hear from you. Are you going to upgrade your Instagram content marketing strategy for 2022? And if so, how? Comment below. I do read your comments. And if you want more help in terms of distinguishing yourself from the crowd and increasing your trustworthiness in the eyes of your niche, I actually have a freebie for you to pick up called 10 Reasons Why You're Viewed as a Fake Guru and How to Gain Credibility and Customers Instead. And you can pick it up at don'tbeafakeguru.com. The link for you to score that freebie guide is in the show notes or the description down below. There you have it. You now have my answer when it comes to the subject of my 2022 Instagram strategy. Why I'm changing. Need more help? Be sure to check out these two awesome videos too because they'll teach you great content marketing strategies that can also help to blow up your business. Enjoy.